Now, uh, more specifically, now I'm working on a technique to identify sex in young turtles. So, as you probably know, but some people might not, is sea turtles, when they hatch, both males and females look exactly the same. There's no way that you can pick up a baby turtle and identify if they're boys or girls. Take about 25 years for them to become sexually mature, which is crazy. Um, and, currently, and currently, there's only really two techniques that you can use to identify sex in young turtles. The first one is via uh, histology, so that means kind of opening up the turtle, taking the gonad, which is the organ that will become the ovary or the testes, you have to take that out and then look at it under a microscope. And then looking at the differences, you could tell if it's a male or a female. But of course, that means you have to sacrifice the turtle, which is the last thing you want to do when you're working with an endangered species. Right. So, so a lot of, you know, we don't want to do that. Um, and then the other technique, which is what we do in our lab, is we raise the turtles. It's called laparoscopy. So that uh, we raise the turtles for about three months till they're a certain size. Mm -hmm. And then we put a little camera inside of the turtle to look at the reproductive sex organs. And then that way we can identify if they're boys or girls. But that also has a lot of shortcomings because you have to raise turtles in the lab. So it's time consuming. Mm -hmm. It's really expensive because you have to feed all those uh, hungry little turks. Mm -hmm. um, <laughs> and it requires the expertise of somebody that can actually do the surgery, right? So there's very few people in the world that can actually do that on young turtles. So right. that's what got me on this uh, kind of mission to come up with an easier way to identify the sex in, in young turtles.